All right, welcome to DACW Live Lounge. This is Sean. We are here. It's 4 p.m. This is a Marvel premiere break that we're going to be doing, just like every other break. Um, we're going to break the case open. You guys will see everything. We'll post the video up, give you about 24 hours to take a look. Send us what you want. Uh, we're going to be doing the draft tomorrow at 4.30. Uh, it's worked for every other draft that we've done. Um, but that way you get to, everyone gets to see it. That way if you're not here for the live draft, you can watch the video, email us your list, or be in the chat room at 4.30 tomorrow to do it. Show you real quick. There's everybody that bought a spot. We got Bobby P, Chad B, you got two, Dom C's got one, Dylan E, Mark G, Mark M, Michael G, and Travis P has two. We're gonna do the random after we do the break. You'll know what spot you have, so it makes it more exciting that way. At least that's what the other breaker says, so just following what he says. All right, without further ado, here we go. We're here for the Marvel Premiere 2014 draft number three. We're just going to be doing the break today. Like I said, you'll have time to see what you want. You can do your homework. All that good stuff. Alex will be so kind. He will email you a link to the video and... A list of all the cards that were pulled. Oh yeah, of course we could do that. All right, let's get into it here. magic. Ooh, there's a new one. I have a Professor X. Very nice. Two panel sketch. Oh, very cool. Very, very nice. All right. It's a good way to start. All right, we have Daredevil. Whoops, Daredevil base. I have Mystique base, and this one's numbered five of 25. Oh, very nice. Amazing Fantasy Shadow Box, Spider-Man. There you go. S uh, CSB3, classic covers. All right. We have first sketch up. It's a very nice looking Ghost Rider. Very nice. Looks like it's Borgantos. And a Gamora. Very cool looking. Yeah, all the sketches are 101. Very cool. And don't worry, we're going to do a recap at the end, and I will focus up on the artist and all that so you can see him.
if I did the one on one button, the computer for this break, the computer would go crazy. I tried doing it the first one that I broke. Oh, this is very cool. Very nice. Obviously a Cosmos. Wish I knew all of them. Captain Marvel, Miss Marvel. Got me swinging. That's Cosmic Spider-Man right there. Wow, this is sweet looking. Very nice looking. Oh, Pulsar, okay. Very cool. Let's see. Let's see. Well, once again, we're off to a great start. All right. We have a Mystique base. This one's just, this is regular. Uh, Mephisto. He likes to show up in every single break we have. Have a nice Misty Knight parallel. 21 to 25. Yeah, there is some new names. A little bit of old. Oh, here you go. An Amazing Spider-Man number one. Oh, man. Nice classic cover. CSB5. And a She-Hulk sketch. Very nice. It would be amazing if we could get the ultimate Spider-Man number one. That's the one. That's ridiculous. Oh, I'm taking I want this box. I'm putting my name in this break. Check out that sweet Wolverine. Oh, yeah. That's awesome looking. Oh, nice. And nice. Oh, that screams 90s. That's fantastic. That's really cool. Don't worry, guys. If, so, if you're just hopping in, I'm going to do a recap. So I'll go back over all the hits that we got. All right, we got Storm base card. Oops, that goes there. Nightcrawler. Punisher. And what is a, a first, another shadow box. This one's giant size X-Men number one. We're three for three on the shadow boxes. This is CSB 25. And it wouldn't be a complete X-Men box without a mini Wolverine sketch. And that one looks awesome as well. Very cool. Okay. Oh. Check out this rocket raccoon. Holy cow. That's fantastic. There he is on the back. Classic comic version. That's actually, if you bought the uh, Marvel Legends action figures, that's exactly what it looks like. That drawing on the front, though, is awesome. 
Very cool. Very nice. We've very nice sketches so far. It's a very thick pack here. Ah, we got the Red Hulk base. A lot of good cards are coming out of this. A lot of people are going to go home happy tomorrow. Ronin base. We have the Apocalypse base. Another Shadow Box Amazing Spider-Man 33. SCB 16. We're 4 for 4 on the Shadow Boxes, which is fantastic. Oh, this is new. An F for Iron Fist. This is the first Iron Fist letter that we have pulled. Codename Iron Fist. That's cool. Gets its own spot. And then we got a really cool looking uh, Crossbones. Very nice. Two more boxes left. The letter was Iron Fist. Oh my. This is like, this is childhood right here. How about this sweet looking saber tooth? Again, screams 90s. Amazing. Very cool. Oh, there it is. Yeah, Sabretooth. This literally... This goes spot on with the Wolverine. Very cool looking. <laughs> all right this is going to be our first no shadow box in this one but that's all right ronin and another ronin base another apocalypse base got a gene gray out of 25 15 of 25 got the g in thor We don't have any cases to put up. We've gone through them all. It, we have gone through so many cases of these. Uh, hopefully we'll get some more in, because we definitely definitely want to do it. We got this bad boy. There's only one. That's right. It's a non-one of one, or a one of one, but it's not a sketch. Sweet looking green goblin printing plate. The cyan printing plate of the Green Goblin. Yes, it's a G Thor. His code name is Thor. So why there's a G? Maybe it spells out. I don't know. Got me swinging on that one. Oh, okay. Mighty Thor. That makes sense. Yep. And our sketch is Storm. Continuing the X-Men flavor. Very cool. Oh, going a little old school with the Mohawk. She might be right. Oh, man. There's so much going on with Marvel right now. There we go. Winter Soldier, I believe. Very cool looking card. Yeah, Secret War is all over the place. 
There he is, a little color on the front there. Um, yes, there's, there's multiple universes for every single thing. But that Secret Wars is crazy. Yeah, the sketches, the def they definitely were above par for this case. Okay, we got a Valkyrie base, Cyclops base, Magneto base. Mm, Miss, I believe Miss Marvel. It's passion. Passion is a powerful feeling, and it can lead individuals to do things both great and heinous. Ba passion for one's vac uh, vocation or for fellow man can lead to great achievements due to the accompanying dedication that can produce wonderful accomplishments. But misguided passion can also lead individuals to dastardly acts. Uh, 27 of 50. And these are, these emotion cards are, um, sketch cards. They're one of ones. The front is, uh, one of one. And we're gonna end on, this is really cool, Apocalypse. That's really cool. It's different. It's a lot different than the sketches that we get. Just a headshot. Very menacing. Subtle, but... Interesting use of white space, if you're an artist, but, uh, I don't know, it's different. Alright. We'll recap. In no real particular order, but, in I guess kind of order, I'll do the, so we have this. Whoops, four panel sketch card. All right, the cosmic sketch card. It's actually seven panels all together. Uh, there's a close up, Monsanto. Then we have our three panel. We have a Wolverine. Um, oh, there we go. There's the back. There's the signature. Adriana. Then we have the saber tooth. I'll get a close up on that. Oops, went too close. There we go. And here's the back. Then we have the rocket. Oops. Obviously, there's the M. I believe he signs. Oh, he didn't sign it on the back. There it is. Right down there. There it is. So we got the rocket. Two panel. We have the winter soldier. Two panel. Signature. Then we have the Professor X. And get a close up on the artist's signature. And there's the back. Again, there's a close up. That way you guys can do your research. Um, then we have the emotions booklet. Twenty seven of fifty. Um, and we'll do the sketch cards. We had the apocalypse floating head, uh, Miriam Kim, I believe. There it is. We 
had the Storm. And there's the signature right on the front. Rustico. Have the Crossbones. That is the mark right there. There we go. Not exactly sure who that is. We have the Wolverine. Like it, full bleed to the corners. The She Hulk. We had Gamora, MCT, nothing on the back, sweet looking Ghost Rider, again full bleed right to the corners, we had the Green Goblin 101 printing plate, Cyan. We had the G for Mighty Thor, and the F for Iron Fist. We have Amazing Spider-Man 33 classic covers, the Shadow Box 16. We had the Giant Size X-Men classic covers, number 25. We had the Amazing Spider-Man number one, which was number five of the set. And the Amazing Fantasy Spider-Man number 15. And that's uh, three of the set, number three of the set. We had a Jean Grey parallel out of 25. We had the Misty Knight parallel out of 25. The Mystique parallel out of 25. Then, let's see, okay, Magneto Base, Cyclops, Valkyrie, Red Hulk, Punisher, Nightcrawler, Storm, Mephisto, Mystique Regular Base, Daredevil, and then we had two Apocalypse base cards, one uh, 109, the other one was number 52. And we had two Ronin base cards, number 8 and number 26. All right. Now, let me switch over or find out. So, oops, this we do not need. All right. We'll random the numbers first. Just like we would random a team if this is the first time and you're wondering what's going on. We random the team. So, for this, we random the numbers. Twelve times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And now we'll random our ten participants. Six times. One. Two, three, four, five, four, five, there we go, and six. There it is. 
So, Dylan with the seventh spot, Travis with the third, Dom with the second, Chad with the eighth, Michael with the sixth, Mark with the tenth, Travis with the ninth, Chad with the fifth, Mark with the first, Bobby P with the fourth, and I know that's kind of hard, so show you guys this. We got Mark M in the first spot, we got Dom C in the second spot. Travis P coming in at three. Bobby P doing the fourth. Chad B with the fifth spot. Michael G, sixth spot. Whoa, it is not Z Dylan, it would be Dylan. Dylan E at seven. Chad B at eight. Travis P, 9, and 10 is Mark G. Oops, Mark G. And then it's a snake draft, and it goes back. So, Mark G, Travis P, Chad B, Dylan E, Michael G, Chad, come on now, Bobby P, Travis P, Dom C, Mark M. There you go. That's our draft order. guys there there it is uh like i said the the draft will be at 4 30 um alex is gonna be kind enough he will email you um he'll email you that again so you'll see where you pick um and then he'll email you uh, all the listing of all the cards uh, and you can look at that and the video that will be downloaded tonight and you, you know it gives you about Almost 24 hours to do your research and come up with your list. Feel free to email us our list if you don't think you're going to be there at 4.30. Visit, or, you know, or if you're going to be live in the chat, be there. Do both. Um, if we don't get a list from you and you're not in the chat, then you know we will pick the cards based on the best that we can. But so far, everyone's been in the room or sending us an email. So uh, make sure you do that. It's the best way to do it. Uh, this is Sean. You were in the lounge, and uh, apparently we're going to have a uh, personal case break coming up, so that'll be fun. Um, all right, we'll see everybody later.